One of the cunning things you can do with count control loops is you can take advantage of the fact that this local variable counter goes up by 1 every time. Let's say I wanted to count from 1 to 10. I would change how long my loop runs for like that. And in my output message, I would just output the variable counter. Because the first time around the loop, counter is 1, so it prints it out as 1. The next time it's 2, so it prints out 2. The next time it's 3, and so on and so on. Let's have a little look at that. There we go, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And I've left my this line gets printed when the loop finishes in there just to help you understand that after next, after it finishes repeating that many times, the loop then moves on to the next line of code. What you might see sometimes is loops like this. Now you've got to beware there, because if counter starts at zero, then it's going to repeat there, not ten times, but eleven, because zero is also a repetition. So if you count on your fingers from zero to ten, starting with zero, you'll actually count eleven fingers. Um, Another cunning thing you can do here is you can use that counter variable to do maths. So, let's say we want to do the two times tables. What I can do here is I'm going to make a variable called total. See? As an integer. And here, in my loop, I'm going to write the line counter first, I'm going to print it. Actually, the first one I'm going to do is I'm going to have total gets the value of 2 times counter. So, counter, first time around will be 2 times 1, second time around will be 2 times 2, third time around 2 times 3, the fourth time around, two times four, and so on. Oh, up to 12 times tables there. So, I don't want to write counter there. I want to write the total. Let's print out the total. So, again, we're taking advantage of the fact that that total, that counter actually goes up one every time. So, you can see that I printed out my two times table there. And you could change that to produce any times table you like. So that was the basics around about four loops. Remember they are count controlled, they run a certain number of times every single time. They never change how many times they run.